Skål. Hej, Morse far. Kom. Ja, yeah, hello and welcome to Kimber Bushcraft. Today I'm with Cornelius in uh, my Black Forest, in a place here where I can put up my tent and make fire without uh, disturbing anyone. So, yeah, and I got my uh, hot tent from uh, fire hiking with me, and I also got my little stove from fire hiking that I will put up. And uh, yeah, the weather is fine now, but uh, during the night it'll be freezing point down down to the freezing point out here so I'll have to uh, have my stove up uh, so I can get heat inside my tent I'm looking very much forward to that it's the first time I put up the tent and uh, make a sleep and make an overnight in it uh, and together with my little stove so I'm very excited for that and so are Cornelius and of course I have some uh, food I'll prepare out here uh, a good uh, dinner and uh, some breakfast for tomorrow. So uh, I hope you enjoy that. As you can see, the weather is really nice. It's sunny, no clouds in the sky, and yeah, it's a wonderful place. I'll just show you in a minute. There's a little creek down here that uh, we can go down to uh, at the night and see uh, if there's any fish down there. I don't have any uh, fishing gear with me. Uh, so uh, I won't catch anything, but it's nice to have a stream nearby. It's not many places in, Den in Denmark we have that. So yeah, now I'm going to uh, set up my stove and um, see. Uh, yeah, last time I did that, uh, I had trouble with the chimney, but uh, then uh, Firehacking sent me a video on how to uh, put it together and I'll uh, try to do it that way the right way, so you can see how it's done. Isn't that right, Cornelius? <laughs> I have to have uh, Cornelius on lease because there's horses here. Uh, there are uh, horses riding down here. If I don't have him in lease, he'll run after that. And uh, I'm not interested in losing him. So, now I'm see I can um, sit up the stove and uh, uh, put the chimney together. Yeah, again, thanks to Fire Hiking for sending me uh, the stove and uh, the tent. I'm very grateful for that. And uh, it's a titanium stove, a cool little thing here. I can you just... Thank you. 
Yeah. And uh, those of you who knows me know that I'm not a complete idiot in uh, putting things together, but this is really a hard job uh, assembling this chimney. It's not my favorite, so um, yeah, but it works now, and uh, then I have to put it up. Yeah, now I have to find some firewood so I can uh, have enough firewood for tonight and tomorrow morning when I'm going to cook on the stove. So uh, see if I can find a bed standing somewhere and chop it down. And it's actually beginning to be a little bit cold now, so um, yeah. If it's something I can use. Yeah, it's okay. I just have to find out how long the stove is so I can put in. I think I'll measure with this and see. And I can see uh, the wood have to be this size, approximately, and it could be in the show. Yeah, and I promised you to, uh, you could see what's down here. A little creek. Isn't it beautiful? So nice.
now it's time for lining up my stove so I can make my my dinner. Smoke is coming up in the chimney. Yeah, and this is what we're going to have tonight. A couple of steaks that I put on some Montreal spice back home. Uh, some mushrooms and some potatoes. And um, the only thing I want to do is slice some potatoes here. And uh, some oil on. bit of salt on it's garlic salt a little bit of this again on cold spice my favorite these off, potatoes, perhaps they'll come over again to cook with the rest, but now they are almost done. Oops, yeah, and the last one. And then Now I think it's finished, so I put over my water for my coffee. Yeah, looking good. A beer for it. Then I think we're good to go. Perhaps I should give Cornelius some meat first. Take a little bit of this off. You 
goods. Yeah. <laughs> Your stomach is making sounds, can you just? You must be very hungry. It's a little bit hot. I have to wait. Yeah. A little bit of potato, perhaps. I don't think you'll eat it. But as with a little grease on, it'll be nice for you. So delicious. Bon appetit. Get the beer. It's a Danish beer. Yeah. Mm. I think I'll give you a little bit more with potatoes. something a little bit more for you here you are the, it's the last part Bit of salt in. Yeah. Have to be careful. And you can see there's a lot of foam on the surface, and when that is gone, uh, then it's finished. finished. I just put it here, let it rest. I can also hear a dog. 
Hmm? <laughs> He's a good watchdog. He really takes care of me and keeps me safe. And uh, for those of you who are interested, my um, sleeping pad is a tamarisk, just uh, an old one, but it's very uh, good quality. And um, yeah, it's only two seasons. I can't use it during the cold times, but uh, that doesn't matter. And yeah, my sleeping bag is from. Um, one tigress and it's uh, down uh, and can uh, go down to minus uh, 16 degrees Celsius. It's really awesome. Uh, one tigress, they make awesome stuff, and this one is actually not it's so expensive. So I just have to blow this up. So, um, yeah. This is my setup for tonight, and uh, for Cornelius I got a wool blanket, a nice warm wool blanket, and uh, I got my anorak, and I'll put that on uh, in a short while because it's getting cold. Uh, but I've used this as a pillow during the night. And the um, good thing about uh, I have a sleeping uh, area that I can lock so I can have Cornelius in here without leash and uh, yeah otherwise I'm sure he will run out during the night so it's a good idea to have him uh, locked in with me.
Yeah, it's getting late now and uh, it's almost completely dark. It's been a wonderful evening out here and uh, Cornelius is enjoying himself, eating all my, <laughs> my firewood that I prepared. But that's okay, most of it was uh, wet, so I can't use it. So luckily I have a little bit with me from home. So um, yeah, it's all good. Now we're going in uh, to the tent and uh, just have a cozy time there until we sleep. It's about 10 o'clock and uh, yeah. Thank you for joining me on this little adventure. And uh, yeah, then I hope to see you again in the morning. We are going to prepare some uh, delicious breakfasts and uh, hanging out here until we are going home. Yeah. Isn't that right, Cornelius? We're going to sleep now. I hope you won't hear noises all night, so uh, to keep me awake. But uh, yeah. That's the way it is. Good night, folks. Sleep well. See you tomorrow. Are you hungry, Cornelius? Breakfast, bacon and eggs.
goes. In a moment, can I just send their food for you? Morning coffee. Yeah. So nice. I think it's time for Canadians to have his breakfast. There you are. Breakfast is served. Ah, it's good. It's good. Don't worry. Be happy. I hate this army for. Oh God. Hmm? Yeah, good morning everyone. <clears throat> yeah, I put, I took down the chimney uh, last night and I decided to make uh, my breakfast on my fireball. Uh, it's easier, quicker, and uh, yeah, then I don't have to cool it down the little stove. But it's been a, a cold night. The stove kept us warm um, as long as I stood up and and uh, put some firewood in. But uh, about midnight, I fell asleep and then there was cold until about eight o'clock when we rised and uh, yeah and saw the wonderful weather today it's really beautiful and uh, delicious meal you, you saw breakfast um, bake, bacon and eggs it's always good and I think Cornelius likes it too and of course my morning coffee very important now it's time for a pipe of tobacco and then uh, just sit here and relax. I can see Connie is eating away. Perhaps you'll have my last X. I think it's first time he got X. Yeah. And uh, he seems to like it. So, yeah. Time for a pipe of tobacco. Relaxing, enjoying life. And uh, for those of you who doesn't know that, I don't come whiskey in my coffee in the morning. Mm.
just should be sitting over in the sun. Hmm? Uh, this is the view from my chair. I can sit here and look down on a creek. It's so beautiful. Pure tranquility. Having a good time, although he doesn't like to be on leash, and me neither because he's dragging the leash uh, around my gear, so it falls down. Yesterday, my fireball was hit twice, and uh, my camera, my tripod. So, it's not perfect, but yeah, it's the way it has to be. <laughs> what do you see? I got to say, Cornelius. Got to say no. Folks, this was all for now. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I think it won't be a short video, but I uh, hope you enjoyed it anyhow. Uh, now we are staying here a couple of hours, enjoying our time out here, and then I'll pack my gear and heading home and uh, edit this video and launch it, I think, Sunday. So, uh, yeah. Again, wonderful time, two days out here in a little camp together with Cornelius with my hot tent, my new hot tent, my little stove and just having a good time. Yeah. Thank you again for watching Kimmer Bushcraft. I really appreciate that. And then I hope to see you again on the next one. Bye bye and take care.